you really build muscle after you're 50 years old? Or is it just too late? It's time to give up. Let's take a look at the science. By the time you're 50 years old, there's a good chance you've lost some muscle mass. Both men and women generally start losing muscle mass as they age if they aren't engaged in regular physical activity that stimulates muscle growth. And since statistics show that our population is over 70% overweight and out of shape, we can probably believe that over 70% of us are engaged instead in losing valuable muscle mass. Most people see their muscle mass diminish around 3% to 5% per decade after turning 30. Old and young people build muscle in the same way, but as you age, many of the biological processes that turn exercise into muscle become less effective. While the basic biology of all people, young or old, is more or less the same, something is behind the lack of senior citizens in professional sports. So what changes in a person's muscles as they age? Well, research has shown that in young muscle, a little bit of exercise produces a strong signal for the many processes that trigger muscle growth. In older people's muscles, by comparison, the signal telling muscles to grow is much weaker for a given amount of exercise. The same research showed that when younger men exercise, there are changes in the expressions of more than 150 genes. But when older men exercise, they found changes in the expression of only 42 genes. This difference in gene expression seemed to explain at least partly the more visible variation between how young and old people respond to strength training. Another reason it gets more challenging for you to hold on to muscle mass after 50 is anabolic resistance. This is when your skeletal muscle gradually loses the ability to make or synthesize protein. Protein synthesis enables you to build up strength when you exercise. As that ability lessens, it gets that much harder for you to build and maintain muscle mass. And finally, hormone levels like testosterone and estrogen decline in both men and women as they age. However, none of this means that you can't boost your overall muscle mass if you're over 50. Exercise still remains one of the most important activities older adults can do for their health. While younger people may get stronger and build bigger muscles faster than their older counterparts, older people still get incredibly valuable health benefits from exercise, including improved strength, physical function, and reduced disability. And regular exercise, especially resistant training, can help mitigate hormone changes and promote hormone balance. So can we build muscle after we're 50? The answer is of course you can. In fact, if you're just getting started, you're probably going to see more improvements than you would if you've been doing it your entire life. So if you haven't started, get started. And if you have started, keep it up. And just remember that by doing that, you're improving your health, your mobility, and just your overall quality of life. And now let's take a look at some people who are proof positive that you can build muscle after you're 50 years old. And thanks for watching.